Hey, what's up? My name is Nick and I'm a bit of a Hackintosh user. Today we're going to be unboxing this Fenvi T919 PCI Express to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth extension. And we're going to see if this gives us Wi-Fi and Bluetooth out of the box, handoff feature and the rest, or do we need to do some extra modifications and if it works at all, let's jump right into it. So this is the box this Wi-Fi adapter comes with. As you can see, it has 1750 megabits per second transfer speeds and boasts Bluetooth 4.0. It has four antenna ports at the back, two of which are used for the Wi-Fi, the other two for Bluetooth. Installing the card is pretty straightforward. All you have to do is find a PCIe 1X slot and a USB 3 header. The USB 3 header is used to control the Bluetooth, while the PCIe Express is used for the Wi-Fi. To install it correctly, all you have to do is slot it in and make sure that the USB cable is facing the right direction. Then screw everything into place and screw in the antenna and you're ready to go. All right, and after initial boot up, let's see how it works. So you can see I'm running Catalina 10.15.3 and it's working absolutely great. Uh, the Wi-Fi card is enabled and here's all the lists. And the most important part, of course, is the airdrop and both my iPhone and my iPad are being detected and I've made a test and it works great. Uh, here are the Bluetooth. Picks up, works absolutely fine. So overall it works great. My handoff feature is not working, but uh, I guess I should do a bit more testing to figure that out. And of course, the internet speed. To be honest, it's kind of meh. I mean, in my tests, I'll get anywhere from 70 to up to 100. And as you can see here, 60, 60, 50, 60, and so on. Considering that my ethernet speed is a full gigabit, it's uh, a bit disappointing. But it works. So to sum up, would I get myself one of these again? Sure, for 50 bucks? Excellent. I don't think it's such a bad deal. I mean, the Wi-Fi works, the Bluetooth works, handoff feature needs to be edited just like everything else with Hackintosh, but overall I think it's great. Uh, the biggest part about this thing is that I put it on my computer, I plug it in and I change it to no settings. It works out of the box. Big thumbs up for that. And I can use the airdrop feature, which for me personally is the most important part, my phone file, my computer, send. That is the reason I bought it. And if that's the thing that you want, then that will work. Should work. Depending on the system. Anyways, um... However, the Wi-Fi speed is not so great. I get much better results through my Ethernet. So if you're looking to get a good Wi-Fi speed connection, then I don't know, if you look elsewhere, maybe this works out fine. Oh, and by the way, if you're buying this off eBay and you can't find it under $50, contact the seller. Chances are they're willing to wiggle down a bit on the prices. This has been Nick from Angry Reviews. Uh, go hack and tosh me. Oh, and uh, like, subscribe, do whatever else, those things that you do at the end of the videos. Totally! Great card.